This is Dan Kingsley, storage specialist for Sun Microsystems, here to introduce you to the new Sun StorEdge 3320 Storage Array. Thanks for joining me. In this brief introduction, I'll be giving a visual overview of the following items. The out-of-box experience, features and benefits, easy hardware maintenance, port configuration examples, and where to go for more information. The 3320 replaces the 3310 with faster throughput, better RAS features, and Rojas compliance. The 3320 SCSI array features ultra-fast, ultra-320 SCSI LVD technology, dual hot swap redundant power supplies and fans, single or dual RAID controller configurations, single or dual bus options, up to 12 SCSI drives in the main chassis and the option of up to two more expansion chassis for a maximum of 36 drives. The available hard disk sizes are 73 gigabyte 10,000 RPM, 73 gigabyte 15,000 RPM, 146 gigabyte 10,000 and 15,000 RPM, as well as 300 gigabyte 10,000 RPM an astounding 10.8 terabytes of data in one array stack. Now that we've seen the basic features of the 3320, let's take a look at the array itself. The front of the 3320 array can contain up to 12 disk drives. Not shown are the two expansion arrays, which allow this product to scale up to 10.8 terabytes. On the right side are the LED indicators for power, temperature, errors, and a reset push button. The disk drives in the 3320 array are easily removed for upgrade or servicing. Here's the business end of the 3320. This array can be ordered with single or dual RAID controllers. Shown here is the dual RAID controller model. The port module is at the top. This is where the configuration, dual bus or single bus, is selected, as well as where hosts and expansion units would be plugged in. There are two controllers which each have a Cat5 Ethernet connection and a serial port connection for out-of-band management. You can also see the event monitoring units to the right of the controllers. The RAID controller units can be easily removed and returned for service by the customer, a reseller, or by Sun Services. RAID controllers are active-active and protect your customer's access to data in the event of a RAID controller or path failure. The 3320 is also available in a JBOD configuration without controllers. The 3320 is available with either AC or DC redundant power supplies. They're easily removable and serviceable to keep the array running in the event of a power supply failure. I hope you're enjoying this close-up view of the 3320. Next, I'll show you a couple of ways to configure the unit for use within a customer's environment. The SE3320 can operate in two bus modes, single and dual. All of the SCSI IDs will be configured on a single channel in single bus mode. This configuration is easily accomplished by hooking up the included jumper cable to the correct ports as outlined here in the quick video example. 
Dual bus mode allows the array to be virtually split into two units, with half of the available SCSI IDs on one channel and the other half on another channel for access by different hosts. Thanks for tuning in to learn about the SE3320 storage array. For more information on this product, you can visit our website, www.sun.com. This is Dan Kingsley, signing off.